Hello, you guys. Let's do some Lashify Lashes. This is the Lashify Lash collaboration with Cenogen, so you can actually get this through me. This is kind of my messy set right here because I actually am not going to go straight from here. The collection that you get comes with a short, medium, and long length lash florets and I believe there are eight florets of each size that you get with your kit. Um, I've been kind of doing a series where I've uh, went from taking my lashes off to um, showing you in the next video how to clean them. Now I'm going to show you how to apply them. So I've actually got my lashes already set out on my towel just breathed and moved them. I kind of organized them a little bit like how I want them to be. These are all the florets. So they come in, <clears throat> it's easier actually to see it from here, sizes, short, medium, and long. Like I said, I mostly wear short and medium just because my eye space is a lot smaller. I don't have as big of an eye space. You might find when you're using these, I really recommend playing around with them and like where you're gonna put them and how you're going to apply them. You might find that you like the longer ones. You might like the long length and the medium length. Um, the cool thing about these is you can also do, you know, short here and then work your way out to long, or you can do different eye looks. So that would give you more of a cat eye. If you want more of a doll eye look, you might do two long ones right in the middle and you might do shorter here and shorter here um, on the outside that would give you more of a doll eye look um, and you can also I'm going to show you guys this but you can also layer lashes on top of each other so <clears throat> I can use like maybe all short and then I can show you that I can add mediums like from here out and build that on top of the shorts that I already have so you really, when when you get your set, I recommend playing around with it because when I first got them, I was like, I don't really like these. I don't like how they look on me. I feel like it's weird. Like, I just feel like it looks weird on me. And that's because I was following what someone else did for their eye, sh eye shape. Once I played around with it more, I was like, okay, I'm obsessed with these. I wear them all the time. I wear them for almost a week and a half, basically, before I take them off, wash them, clean them and then put them back on again. So this is my same set um, from here, from my collection that I got, and um, I just reuse them over and over again. So I'm gonna start off, and I'll probably only do one eye with you guys here because it just takes a minute to do it. I like to like turn on a show. I like to sit on the floor because I'm comfortable, so I'm sitting on the floor in my room. Um, I've got this big mirror that's behind me. I like to just sit at and like do it while I'm watching a show or listening to a podcast. Um, and once it's there, it's set. A couple things to know is you want to when you're applying your lashes, you don't want to do it before you're going to go take a shower or before you're going to wash your face. A lot of the time, I actually put my lashes on after I've washed my face, cleansed my face, um, and I'm about to go to bed. Then I'll put my lashes on and sleep with them because then they're drying and they're staying really good and they're not going to get anything that interferes with them. So I sleep with my new set on and then wake up in the morning and then wash my face. Um, so you just don't want to wash or shower within like probably 10 <laughs> hours of putting them on. Um, you know, if you give yourself 24 hour period, that's going to be even better. Uh, so you want to make sure that you, when you put these on, that you're going to have a good um, period of time before your face gets wet or they could possibly get wet. Now, I didn't curl my lashes. A lot of people like to curl their their natural lashes before they put these uh, lash uh, Lashify lashes on. Um, but I don't. My lashes are, I feel like, are pretty okay. If you want to give your lashes a curl, then that would be great. I have the Bond, actually. <laughs> warming up between my bosom. Um, I do this with my mascara as well, just to have the bond warming up is gonna make it go on smoother. Um, there are things in the bond that can make it so, I don't know if you've ever put mascara on and you feel like your mascara is clumpy, you need to warm up your mascara because as it sits at room temperature or as it's cold, getting colder, the product in your mascara is going to start sticking together. And same with your bond. If you can warm it up or if you can put it under warm water um, before you put it on, it's just gonna slide on a lot easier. Now this bond is almost like a mascara. So it actually looks a lot like a mascara wand. 
and you're gonna apply it like a mascara. You'll see when I apply the bond, I'm actually like a mascara, I'm gonna come down here to the bottom of my lashes and I'm gonna press it in, but I really don't care about that bond touching the top part of my lashes because when I put these lashes in, stick this back in here, I'm gonna grab one of these long lashes. When I put this lash in, I'm attaching it to the underside of my lashes and at my lash line. You do not want this strip right here to touch your skin. You really are attaching these to the, to the base of your lashes. So you're gonna attach them to your lashes here, not to your waterline skin there. That will be very uncomfortable. If you do these right, you won't feel like you're wearing anything at all. It'll be amazing, it's super lightweight. It adds that light uh, look to your eyes and it's going to be amazing. Now, I just remembered in this video, I titled it, what's your favorite movie as a teen or your favorite TV show as a teen? And we'll talk about that as I'm putting this on because I'm actually going to pick up my little sis from her her job in just a little bit so I wanted to put these on before I head out the door and then do other errands and my sister she's actually 15 and I, I like remember when I was 15 and I'm gonna start putting this bond on while I talk to you guys and um I remember I I mean, she's to the age where I like actually have memories of when I was 15 and the things that I was doing. I actually started dating my husband, Jordan, if you guys know him, when I was 16, but I met him when I was 15. So like, I remember this time in my life. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna touch this to the base of my lashes and I'm just kind of not gonna do anything else. I don't want it to be like clumpy. I don't like it clumpy. A lot of people feel like they can feel their lashes sticking together too, the top to the bottom. So I like to try to just keep my eyes open so that they don't touch, almost like lip sense. Like you don't want to touch your eyes together until it bonds. Um, now I'm going to stick this in my leg, <laughs> just let it warm up. But her, okay, wait, one more thing. When you put that bond on, you don't have to hurry and like put your lashes on. It's gonna stay there for a while and you can just like take your time putting your lashes on. There's no stress, no rush. Um, if you need to put more uh, of the bond on because it's not sticky anymore, you can do that. I'm gonna show you guys a hack that I like to do with my bond in just a second. But um, my sister, 15, I'm gonna go pick her up in a little bit. Her initials are A and C. Actually, I'm gonna show you guys this. I stick it in between my leg because I sit on the ground and I do my lashes on the ground. I'm gonna untwist this and I hold it like this and it's between my leg like this and I tap the strip of this lash and just get more bond on it like that. So I've got bond on my lashes and I got bond on here. Um, and her initials are her initials are A and C. So I call her AC. So I'm like, yo, AC, you ready to go? Or I'll go, hey, AC Slater. Like, I just call her AC now all the time. I, I tend to like make nicknames for people. So I call her AC instead of her name. And my husband's like, do you think she actually knows what that stands for? And I was like, I don't know. I don't know if she actually knows where I'm getting that from. Now I'm gonna touch this to my lash. as easy as that folks and I was like I don't think she really knows what I'm where I get that from and I was like Aria do you know who AC Slater is and she's like no I'm just like dumbfounded you don't know who AC Slater is <laughs> like it's just we've gotten to this world of you know the uh, these um is it Gen Z Gen Z doesn't know who Saved by the Bell characters are. That was my favorite show when I was a teen. Saved by the Bell when I was her age. Saved by the Bell, Full House, Family Matters. All those shows were like my favorite shows at her age and she has no idea who AC Slater. Iconic, iconic. AC Slater is iconic. If you guys know who that is, give me some hearts and then tell me if you're uh, Team Zach or Team AC Slater. Um, so what I'm doing is I put that bond on another florette, I hold it by the bottom, and then I just touch that florette to my lash line, 
and then I kind of, I like to just tap it like this at the bottom and just like get that bond to stick a little bit. So I'm just adding those lashes on and you can start to see what that's looking like. I'll take the wand and it's shaped like this so that you can clamp it this way. Uh, for some reason, I don't work like that. I can't get it to work that way. So I flip it upside down and I use this back end to clamp it. So I'm just gonna take this and I'm gonna clamp, go between these lashes here. And just clamp. If you feel like it gets stuck to your lashes, just wiggle back and forth like this until it loosens up. Anyways, I gotta go pick up AC Slater in just a little bit. Now, my lashes, you can see one of my natural lashes is going this way a little bit, if you can see that. Uh, sometimes I like to just move my lashes around with the back end of this wand. Things are going skew on this. It's not gonna work. It's not gonna work and my lash is gonna be skew on this. What's your guys' favorite show as a teen? I cannot get that to work. And I can't see comments while I'm live for some reason. So I can see you guys are on, but I can't see if you guys have said anything. Okay, so I'm going to look up close. Look how natural that looks. Look how natural those lashes look. I wish I could, if I had something right now, to fix that one lash because it's driving me crazy. Hold on. I'm going to pull this up closer so I can see it. You guys aren't going to be able to see it very well, but it's easier for me to work this way. See how long I'm going in between putting up on each florette? I think a really long time. That natural lash is going to drive me crazy, so I'm going to have to do that in a little a little bit later and fix that. But you can just get your, the back side of this and kind of move your natural lashes. This is why some people curl their lashes before they put them on. So they don't, like their natural lashes aren't looking weird. So I've got two, I've got two florets. That's what they call them, okay? I've got two florets on. I usually find that it takes about four florets along my lashes. Um, if I'm gonna build more, obviously, if I layer more, it's gonna take even more in a set. So like in one of these, you get one size that's gonna have eight of one size in it. And then you're gonna have the next size up, it's gonna have eight si eight florets in it. So you really can mix and match, make your own look. And then you can even have leftover ones. You're gonna have a, it's, it's like you can do a couple new sets each you know, time. You guys, can you hear the flies in my room? They're driving me crazy. Okay, we're gonna go to the next one, the next over. To set. Remember, we're going to the lash. We're not attaching it to our skin, to that waterline, none of that. We're doing it right at the base of that lash because as it sits under that lash, you're not gonna be able to feel anything. It's magical. Also, look at this, look at the, almost the, um, what is it called? It almost looks like I lined my eye really close. It almost looks like it gave me a liner, an eyeliner. See, look at how that's thicker than this side. So I have three medium on, or small. I think these are short. Sorry, sometimes I call them small. So I'm going to go through. I'm just going to pinch that bond and let go. I can see some of my ski wampus lashes under here. I pulled that one that's looking so much better. Okay, see that this looks compared to this one? It's just so fun right there. It's gonna drive me crazy. It's okay. I don't wanna do it perfect while I'm on here with you guys. Okay, I'm gonna gather my next ones. I've got it just on a little towel down here. Now, I just blinked my eyes and I felt a little stickiness. Some people don't like Lashify lashes because when they blink, because we have that bond down here, they feel like their lashes are sticking down to the bottom ones down here. A real good tip for that, I don't feel it often. Um, <clears throat> like when mine dries and it's set, I don't feel it. Um, I can feel it right now. <coughs> One thing you can do, 
You just press it, you know? So that's, that tackiness is going to come off on your fingers. Hold on. <coughs> My whole family is getting over sickness. The other thing you can do... <coughs> I got the black lung pops, <coughs> is waterproof mascara. We have a great waterproof mascara. Warm it up. <laughs> Let me get my drink. Hold on. Rolling. I got pants on. Now I'm rolling back. Um, Waterproof mascara. Just get your waterproof mascara. Make sure it's warmed up. And then just touch the bottom with your waterproof mascara on this side. And that's just going to give you a layer of that mascara so that it doesn't feel like any stickiness, like you can feel any bond. Okay, I'm going to put on my last one so you guys can see this. Ooh, I got tips. I forgot to tell you guys these, these tips. When you're putting them on the outside, you want a couple natural lashes on the outside right here. So you can see my natural lash. <coughs> it's so rude for me to be coughing while I'm doing this. Or also on the inside, you want a couple of your natural lashes on the inside. You don't want to take that florette all the way here on the skin. Never set it on the skin, but make sure you have your natural lashes here. It's going to look a lot more natural that way to have your natural lash out here. And it's also going to feel more comfortable. Now, <coughs> oh my God. you guys love me. Hold on. It's my protein shake. <coughs> I was totally fine, but as I've noticed, <coughs> if I keep talking, <coughs> I'm not fine. So. <coughs> Pinch. I should have got my water. That is four florets of the same size. All the way. <coughs> <coughs> Gosh, I wanted this to be a forever video that I could just tag people in forever they're gonna be pretty disgusted seeing me cough so much so might not be a forever video that's all the same size look how natural that looks I love it it's just such a natural it's like if I woke up every morning and I already had my mascara on it's a very natural good look so there's this one you can do all the same size all the way across I'm just gonna pinch them again just gonna pinch them make sure they're there Nice and tight. <coughs> okay, there's just, seriously, I would just wake up and be like, oh, I just like already have mascara on. If I want to add a little more va va voom, which I'm going to show you guys, I'm going to add some longer lashes in. This is going to be added. <clears throat> I'm going to add them from here out, I think. I think I have a fuzzy somewhere. Oh, right here. Okay, now, how do you add Lashify lashes on top of Lashify lashes? You just pretend like they're your normal lashes. So I'm gonna pick up these long ones. I think these ones are actually long. Look how long they are. Except for to me, <clears throat> they, everything seems longer than they actually are because I have short eye space. So this might be medium. Let's see if I can find one. That is long. Look at that one. Wait, I gotta hold this up so you guys can see this. Some people just have a lot more eye space. I am not one of those people. That's a long. That on me would look like so much. So I'm gonna get this medium size now, which is longer than my shorts that I put all the way across my eyes. And I'm gonna lay it. I'm gonna make them look wonderful. So I just get my bond. And I just tap some glue on the end of my lash florette and I'm going to put it at the underneath of <clears throat> the rest of these lashes. Put that one in the middle. I like starting in the middle. Okay, so that's a longer length here. I could stop there if that was the look I wanted to do. But it's not. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to tap a little glue on this one. See how like easy it is to just throw them on? 
I think the first time I put them on, though, I was like, this is, it's different. It's harder. Are, are you kidding me? Look how pretty that is. Look at the line. It's almost like I lined my eyes as well. Look at my lash line here, how bare, <clears throat> bare naked ladies. And then look at the lash line here. It's like I took a black pencil liner and just lined that. I didn't. It's the lash of my lashes giving me some added dimension. Some added va va voom. Pinch it. I freaking love these. Best ever. <clears throat> if you're local to me, <coughs> I, can <coughs> I can do these at my house after I'm done being sick. Because I'll be going for certification. <coughs> this is a great thing about technology. <coughs> I can be at home. Super sick. Still showing you makeup. You guys, I'm sorry I'm so disgusting right now. But I was totally fine all day. Not coughing. <coughs> I was coughing at night. <coughs> But as soon as you want to go live, just about everything horrible that you wouldn't want had to happen is going to happen. I literally accidentally called 911 on my phone once because I like was trying to turn it up and I pushed it like so many times on accident. And I like, if you push it like three times, it calls 911. <laughs> so during the live video, I was like trying to turn up the volume and I called 911. I'm so sorry. I hope you guys still get some value out of this, even though I'm, like, being disgusting. Okay, look at this one. I put it on. It's like we're not gonna, we're not gonna work very well. So all I do is I take it back off. <clears throat> Reposition and try it again. And then I'm gonna get off because I don't want you guys to be so disgusted by me. I love you. Just love me, okay? I came on here imperfect and sick to show you guys this lash stuff. on <clears throat> okay now like the best things ever do I even look sick no my eyes look amazing <laughs> now I'm gonna pinch this last one now you might want to grab your waterproof mascara put those on the bottom Okay, Tracy, I can see your messages. Yay. Okay, I'm going to send you a link. If you buy them through me as a distributor, Lashify has done their first ever collaboration with a, a direct selling company. And they, she said, we will never do it again. We are only doing it with Um, <clears throat> So you can actually buy Lashify sets through a Senegence distributor. And it's actually cheaper to buy it through Sunagen's distributor. So I will attach my link, Tracy. Thank you so much. I actually have like four sets on hand because I'm obsessed with it and I thought my friends were gonna buy a bunch of them because I'm so freaking obsessed with them. <laughs> but I'm like, I think I need to show you guys a little bit more often about how to apply them and how great they are. Now, this is just gonna last forever. I wake up, wash my face, and I'm out the door. I've been going bare-faced like all summer because I have these on. It makes me look like I'm somewhat put together. So you guys, lashes, no lashes. I did do four short all the way across. Then I took, I think maybe three medium length and I doubled it up here, here, and here. Remember, keep your natural lashes on the outside and on the inside. Easy as that, you guys. Freaking love them. Gives you a little bit of a liner look. I hope you guys have a great rest of the weekend. Thank you for suffering through that video with me. Honestly, like I was coughing <clears throat> at night and I went and I slept on the couch so I wouldn't wake Luke who was sleeping with us and Jordan. Woke up totally fine all day until I do this live video. And then my body is like, let's do this. Because if you're alive, something's going to happen. <laughs> so... 
You guys are amazing. Thank you so much. Let me know if you have any questions. If you want to order, I'll have that link up at the top of this video um, as soon as I hop off. Bye.